Fleshwater, Kiss the Ladder, Guitar Tabs, and Guitar Lesson. So for this one, I'm going to be cheating a little bit. I'm going to be doing kind of a lazy drop D flat tuning. Uh, basically, that just means we're going to do like we would a drop D. We just take that low E, drop it down. Uh, but we're going to keep going past D a half step till we get that D flat. And you can basically tune it with yourself here if you have like the fourth fret on the A. Okay, you just want that same note there. So a little bit of a cheat here with the tuning. We'll have the low D flat, then everything else stays the same. A, D, G, B, E. All right, so uh, with that, we'll kind of have some interesting shapes here. This initial chord, it's just a real dissonant thing anyway. And basically we, we want like A flats mixed with an A. So we'll do a seven on this low D flat with the open A and a six on the middle D. And you just hit it, let it ring. And then we get into like the main progression, which initially will be like an E major seven variation here, where we'll have like a three on that low D flat, a two on the A, and a one on the middle D here. And it's just strum, bop, 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 bop. And that's kind of how we're gonna strum each chord. We'll come off to an open low D flat five power chord now, so just leave the open D flat low there, and then a 4A6 on the middle D. Same type of strum. Okay, now we want an A flat suspended second, so we can just kind of keep our power chord on the A and D there. Slide it up to the 6 and 8, and then we add a 7 on the low D flat here. Same strum. Take that same shape and we go down to the E again, but here we want the E suspended second. So we, it's that same exact shape we had there, but we're down at the three on the low D flat, two on the A, four on the middle D, and the same strum again. And we have the little lead section over the top of it. Uh, down here on the high E, we go six, nine, six, seven. And we just kind of hold that for a moment. Do the same thing again, but when we hit that seven, we pull it back off to the six. And basically we just alternate between those two different patterns. And now for this super brief uh, one and only verse here, all right? Uh, the guitar isn't really doing a whole lot. Uh, the bass is kind of like going through the main progression there. And the guitar just hits this kind of single note after a beat or two on the eighth fret. It just kind of rests, just honks its horn, rests, and it just repeats that four times. And this uh, next section here, uh, it's the same progression, but uh, we'll just have single strums. One guitar is just kind of doing a regular single strum thing. The other guitar, which unfortunately I don't have a wah hooked up at the moment, but it's, it's doing a single strum of the same chords. But it has the wah going, and it's just kind of hitting the wah up and down, right on beat, just back and forth. And this outro, it's the same chords, but we're just picking through everything now. We'll do something a little different here for the open low D flat. Uh, we'll start with that same E major style here, the three, two, one. And we basically pick the three on the low D, two A, three low D flat, one on the middle D, three low D flat, one middle D, two A. So it's that same picking style, and we're gonna use it for you know, most of the chords here, so. Now we get to this D flat. We don't have the other strings dropped, so we'll have to improvise a little bit where we'll do the open low D flat, hit the seven up on the low D flat, back to the open, then a six A, open low D flat, six A, 
seven on the low D flat. And now we take our sus2 shapes, the A flat here with that seven, six, eight, pick through it just as we did down here with the E major. Okay, seven, six, seven, eight, seven, eight, six. That same exact shape and picking, drop it down to the three, two, and four. And just crank that out a couple times. 